I'm going to be showing you guys two different methods on how you can create your own channel intro using your phone and i hope you find this video helpful and if you eventually do please blow this video up for me blow it up let it explode on the whole youtube she likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine she likes no say say i love you all the time roses at your feet baby girl be mine hi guys welcome to my channel my name is Chuma. if you're new here please hit the subscribe button to be part of the gang and if you're a returning subscriber what it do what it does you know how we do thank you for coming back so in today's video i'm going to be doing something that's been highly requested that like i got a lot of messages from people asking me how i create my youtube intro so i'm going to be showing you guys two different methods on how you can create your youtube intro with your phone of course before we continue i just want to say that i'll be adding timestamps so definitely check my description box to um check for the timestamps slash timestamps slash chapters okay so the first method here yeah, is a template that's basically downloading templates and just adding your name to it you get like the template already comes with uh, the design the subscribe logo sometimes not always and all you have to do is to just add your name and any other thing you feel like adding so to do that all you have to do is to go on youtube and search for youtube intro templates so they're going to show you like so many templates you can just click on any one you like i'm just going to click on this one So basically when you go on youtube to search for templates they show you the templates and then they give you an example of what it will look like and then they give you the no text one so you um add your own text and whatever and how to download it is to check the description box some of these channels leave the link to um where you can download it while others tell you to just screen record do you understand so some you screen record some you actually download whichever As you can see from this channel they actually have a download link so i'm just going to click on the download link and then i'll open in safari and um it's going to take me to dropbox and now um i'm gonna have to select from the five templates that i just watched so i think i'm gonna go with this star one so this is how it's looking like what i'm gonna do now is to click on these three dots and then i'll click on direct download and it's gonna download then once it's downloaded i'm just going to save video and also open it in my InShot since InShot is what I'm going to be using to add text and then when I go to InShot I'm going to um, change the size to 16.9 that's the YouTube size and once I've done that I'm going to let it load then once it's done loading I'm just going to split here I'm going to stop here and I'll split so what I'm going to do here now is to just add text my name so that's Choma Wano so I'm going to change the font to something cute and then I'm going to resize it just so it's bigger and I'm going to move it to the place where I split. So why you have to split after loading is because you don't want to add your name to where it's loading. You want it to finish loading and then after that, the next thing it shows is your name. Can you see? And then after that, the next thing is um, the subscribe button. Do you get? Now for the subscribe button, what I'm going to do is to save it. So I'm done saving it. I'm going to take it to iMovie. I would import and then I would come to the remaining space that's after my name 
and then I'll go to my camera roll. I have some subscribe um, buttons. So the subscribe button, you also have to get it from YouTube. And then when you want to get a subscribe button, you have to search for green screen because green screen is transparent. If you get the one that has like a background, when you add it, the background is going to um, the background is going to show. So you have to make sure you are searching for green screen. <laughs> green screen. Oh my god green screen subscribe green screen subscribe button Checkout. so now i already have some screen recorded i'm just going to get the one i already have this one and what i'm going to do is click on green screen blue screen so it takes off the green screen in it and this is what it's looking like now we have to extend it it will not come on time Now I'm going to mute the green screen, blue screen that I just added. Yeah, so this is what it's looking like you can make the clip that has your name shorter so the subscribe button can appear full so something you need to know is that when you get intro templates you have to mute the sound because most times the sounds have copyright i've tried it before and i got copyright strike i had to delete the video that had the strike so make sure you always mute the sound and then get a no copyright sound and attach to it so i made a video showing you guys how to get no copyright background music check it out here or here i'm going to leave the link somewhere around here so make sure you check it out and find out how to get no copyright background music okay so now i'm just going to go to my camera roll because i do screen records a lot i'm going to just take out the audio from this video and just use that as my intro music so here's what it's looking like so simple like this first method is really so simple all you have to do is each time you're editing a video just add your intro and voila it's really so simple like this um, template method is really so simple if you don't have the strength to do like something serious like adding your pictures and videos just take this template method now the second method is my current intro which is this one she likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine she this is really so simple i made this myself from scratch to finish like i did everything myself so now i'm going to show you guys how to create something like this or something similar so for the second intro the first thing you're going to do is to get a background of your choice go on pinterest and search for any background of your choice really when you're satisfied with your background you're going to go back to imovie and then you're going to import that background that you just downloaded from pinterest and the reason why we're importing it to imovie is so it turns into a video it was a picture we downloaded it as a picture from pinterest and then we're bringing it to imovie to turn it into a video to get so now you're going to have to turn off the can bonds just so it doesn't move just so it doesn't like move up and down it just like goes straight you understand so you can extend the extended duration personally yeah to me your intro shouldn't be more than 12 seconds because people are not here to watch your intro so you have to make it short but not too short do you understand it shouldn't be more than 12 seconds if your intro passes 12 seconds i'm not even going to be interested so now i've just gotten that to 12 seconds what i'm going to do is to save it and once i'm done saving it i'm going to take it to canva now this process is really long trust me it's long you have to be really patient so i'm gonna take it to canva and i'm just going to click on custom dimensions definitely check out my thumbnail video where i explained how to use canva so you have an idea of the canva app so now i'm just going to create a ratio that's 1600 ratio 900 that's 16 mm. 
1600 ratio 900 and now it's going to create it it's going to go to images sorry camera roll and i'm going to import the video now what i'm going to do is to click on illustrations and search for frames search for framing guys don't search for frames now i'm going to click on this one and i'll just turn it bring it here Oh, we're just going to duplicate this one this is similar to the one i used we're just going to duplicate this one and turn it all right so the next thing i'm going to do is to get my images any picture or video of your choice i'm going to try and fit it into the frame that i've just created I'm going to get a video for this second one and I'm going to fit it so this is what this is looking like so I'm going to click on the play button this play button right here and I don't know why whenever I click on the play button it just removes my original background but whatever I'm going to um, click on rise you can see what rise does basically just to give it more style there's this one there's pan there's slide there's fade and then there's block I'm going to use rise I like rise then I'm going to save it to my camera roll and then once I save it to my camera roll I'm going to write my name now you guys are going to see why I saved it first before writing my name. Now I'm going to write my name Chioma Wano and then I'm going to change the font. So basically I just changed the background to white because that other color was kind of like blocking. So this is what it looks like now. I'm using pan and I'm going to save. So now that I'm done with Canva, I'm going to go back to iMovie and I'm going to import the two videos that I saved from Canva. So here's what it's looking like on iMovie. And then I'm just going to split here and then I'll delete the rest out then I'll delete the other one. And then I'm going to split here. And then what I'm going to do here is to just go to my downloads just get a green screen that's the subscribe green screen and add it i'm gonna get this one that i used earlier don't forget to mute it split and add another green screen which is the like green screen so when you add a green screen on iMovie you want to tap on it and adjust the strength this is what it's looking like so you can do whatever design you want you can add as many pictures and videos as you like it just depends on you and your style i like this kind of intro because i just like something simple something that when someone is watching they're like oh my god i need to continue watching this person's video do you get so now that i'm done with that obviously i'm going to change the music and i'm going to use this my anthem <laughs> this song it's going to forever be my intro music. I love this song so much. This and she's a Mona Lisa. And this is what we have. Can you guys see how simple this is? And how beautiful it actually is. So you really don't have to do much. So basically, there you have it. She likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine. She likes notes that say I love you all the time. Roses at your feet. Baby girl be mine. So basically, you guys, there you have it for um 
my intro creating tutorial you can see i've shown you guys two super easy methods on how to create your own youtube intro one of course is faster and simpler while the other one like takes a lot of time and a lot of apps so you can actually do the second intro that i just showed you guys on imovie and canva or imovie and InShot. i just like to use canva because canva is where i get my frames and i can add although you can add pictures everywhere but i get my frames for canva. i get the frames from canva and then i get like really cute and beautiful fonts from canva just that canva once you add frames and um text is gonna be all through the video do you understand that's why you have to save it twice before you add text and then um, after you add text so that you can cut it and make it like one full intro you understand like i showed you guys so um yeah guys that's basically it thank you guys so much for watching please give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful don't forget to hit the subscribe button and be sure to turn on your bell so you know when i post a new video also check out my youtube startup pack playlist i'm gonna be linking it here i created a playlist to help people who want to start up a youtube channel or people who already have a youtube channel and um are kind of like still figuring out the whole youtube thing so my youtube setup pack just helps you out helps you with stuff you need to know about youtube i talk about thumbnails intros copyright music and whatnot definitely check out that playlist um and have fun yeah leave beautiful comments share this video with your friends and i'll definitely see you guys in my next video stay blessed stay safe and stay happy